And now, Sportsline. For the first time in 24 years, the Pocatello Thunder are 4A boys basketball state champions. They are the only team in East Idaho to bring home a title this weekend. Here's how the Thunder finally got over the hump. Champions never quit. The Pocatello Thunder are state champs for the first time since the year 2000, thanks to an all-time performance from star Julian Bowie. After suffering an injury on this hard fall late in the first half, Bowie stepped up big time, scoring 16 of his 20 points in the fourth quarter. My mentality, I was like, all right, this is it. This is my last ever high school game with my boys. I got to do something, and I went through it. For the first, like, three minutes, I thought I was done. Like, I couldn't walk at all, couldn't do anything. But then I got back to the locker room, and my trainer, shout out to Bryce, he got, he numbed it up with a corner zone patch, and it felt a little bit better, and just battled through it. He's unreal. He's unreal. It brings our entire team together, no matter what. He's our guy that goes... When we have scoring jobs, this is our guy to get us going. He's just unreal. But obviously, it wasn't just Bowie helping Pokey bring home the title because the supporting cast was outstanding. Dre Contreras led Pocatello with 22 points in the championship, and Kessler Vaughn tallied 18 points. They're amazing. They're not scared of the moment, and we put in the work. Nobody's scared of the moment. We've put in the work since 365 days now. You know, they have the mentality that they're best player on the floor as well, which we need. With these standout performances, the Thunder exercised their demons from 2022 and 2023 after losing to Hillcrest in the championship both seasons. Saturday night, the Thunder finally got the best of the Knights. To see them perform the way they did, they've been here three times and it's gone bad for two years. Uh, they pulled together, they never doubted. They were in the gym, they knew they were gonna win a state championship this year. Uh, they did all of this work, they earned it, and I'm just so proud of them. The players that brought home the title weren't even born the last time Pokey won a state championship. And the legacy of Pocatello Boys Basketball and its 11 titles now is not lost on the team. It's so cool. We have so many people that have gone to Pokey. Uh, they just have these guys back. They watch them. They come and come to practice and talk, talk to them. Uh, so we, we got to win this one for them too. It means the world. All of us, 1 through 12, we've wanted this for, like I said, 365 days. That's what all we've been thinking of in the gym. We've all put the work in and it means a lot. For Local News 8, I'm Sports Director Eric Moon.